Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. I hope you're well. The series of earthquakes that occurred in the areas of Turkey and Syria has shaken the world to the core. Everyone is praying for the safety of the victims of the incident and hoping that those who are still under the debris be saved as soon as possible. Countries namely Algeria, Canada, Egypt, Germany, India, Pakistan and many more have sent their aid to the earthquake hit areas. Even Ukraine, which itself is a war-torn country, has promised assistance to Syria and Turkey. Every nation is trying to help the victims through any way possible. Everyone, except France, of course. Not only did the French government not offer any minute help, but also it made fun of the earthquake itself. The infamous newspaper outlet, Charlie Hebdo, made a caricature of the affected buildings and the rubble depicting a scene of the disaster-affected area. The drawing by artist Pierrick June showed teetering buildings amid heaps of rubble with the caption, No need to send tanks. The use of satire was met with immediate and intense criticism on social media as users perceived it as hate speech due to the severity of the disaster and the ongoing rescue efforts. The organization is not showing even slightest feeling of remorse, instead mocking the tragedy itself. What a shame. How down can someone stoop in such sensitive times? This act of yours only depict how much hatred you have towards Muslims and Islam. This act you deem funny is not at all a piece of art or freedom of expression. If you're trying to hurt the sentiments of Muslims by such foolish cartoons, then to your disappointment, we are not at all hurt. We don't expect anything but hate from you. These acts of yours only portray how deep you can stoop and nothing else. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has taught us how to deal with people who are full with hatred towards Muslims and Islam and who try to harm us through their blasphemous words and act. When you see those who are engaged in blasphemy against our signs, turn away from them until they begin to talk of other things. And should Satan ever cause you to forget, then do not remain after recollection in the company of those wrongdoing people. In yet another verse, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala teaches us how to respond to improper acts. We advise our Muslim brothers and sisters to try to stay away from the hateful people as much as possible. They don't even deserve our response. Always keep in heart and mind that this life is not permanent and Allah is not unaware of what they do. <laughs> May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us against the wrongdoers. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala strengthen our iman and nafs so that we may always adhere to the teachings of Quran and Sunnah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help the victims of the Turkey-Syria earthquake. Ameen. That's it for today, brothers and sisters. I hope you liked the video. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. We would love to hear from you. Hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification bell. Share this video with your family and friends. Until next time, Assalamu Alaikum.